Now to the latest developments on the COVID-19 vaccine. Good afternoon, I'm Andy Sirota. Channel 2 is your vaccine central, and we have learned that President-elect Joe Biden plans to release most available vaccine doses to speed up the delivery process once he takes office. Under the Trump administration, the government has been holding back some vaccines to guarantee that people can get a second dose. Meanwhile, Pfizer says its vaccine can protect against the new COVID variant that was first discovered in the UK. Scientists at UTMB helped in the study. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez spoke with one of those doctors. Good afternoon. It is positive news. This morning we spoke to the lead scientist at UTMB who says their work is not done. They will continue to test the virus. Scientists from Pfizer and UTMB in Galveston used blood samples from 20 people who had received the vaccine. They found antibodies from those recipients were able to fend off the variant that has spread across the UK and here in the US. The first case in Texas has been discovered here in Harris County. Dr. She says they were excited to get the news out as soon as they discovered it. A single mutation of the virus, it's less likely that is going to ruin the efficacy of the vaccine. But of course, we need to be also cautious in closely monitoring how the virus is evolving. We need to test more other mutations of the current strain to make sure that the, 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 the current vaccine is, 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 is protective against those strains. Dr. Shi says if the virus mutates enough that the vaccine needs adjusting, it wouldn't be difficult. He says it's similar to adjusting the flu shot most years. Reporting in the Texas Medical Center, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.